right, so in the game, our mascots will hold up two cards at a time, and you have to shout out whether the second fraction is bigger or smaller than the first. And to get us moving, if it's bigger, I want you to reach up. Everybody reach up if it's bigger. That's it. And if it's smaller, you touch your toes. Oh, oh. that hurts. <laughs> and all good games need a referee, of course. So to help us today, Alex, will you do the honours, please? I've got my whistle. Oh, she's got, oh, a, whistle she's got a trusty yeah. whistle. So let's get this game started. So on Alex's whistle mascots, Mighty Red, you're going to start. So, Alex, over to you. <laughs> Three, two, one. Right. Okay, so we have one tenth there from Mighty Red. Monty Magpie, what have we got from you? Ooh. Oh, it's one quarter. Okay, quarter. so we've got one tenth and one quarter. Audience, is one quarter bigger or smaller than one tenth? Show us now. Bigger or is smaller? it bigger, bigger or smaller? Or smaller? Oh, I'm Lots seeing of arms a up. lot of lot arms in the air. Up. I think the audience think it's bigger. Katie, are they correct? It is bigger. Yay! 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 Yes, it is bigger. And let's flip those boards around, mascots, and see how that works with our watermelon pieces. Yes. Yeah. So you can see quite clearly, one quarter is much, much bigger, bigger than a tenth. Yes. Uh, fantastic. Well right. Done. Now well done, uh, we're going to go for the next one. Harry Hornet, what have you got for us? Ooh, Ooh, one third. third. Okay. And uh, what have you got for us, Sammy the Saint? Uh, one fifth. So, do we My think th uh, one fifth is bigger or smaller than one third? Is it fifth bigger, bigger or, smaller? or smaller? Smaller than a third. Ooh. Everyone, oh, there's a lot of touching not their quite toes. Sure yet. Lots of touching their toes. All the time, the shoelaces. We don't know. <laughs> Katie, lots of touching the toes. Do we think it's smaller? It is smaller. Yay! Yes, it's smaller. Let's flip the boards and make sure we got that right. Yes, and as you can see, it's smaller than that one. Fantastic. So, shall we have one last yeah, go? Boy. This last one is a little trickier. As the numerator, that's the number at the top, is different. So, uh -oh. Katie, can you explain what we do if the numerator is more than one? If the numerator on top is more than one, you're going to have to think a bit more carefully. So, I guess if the denominator on the bottom is the same in both fractions, so you might have, say, two tenths and three tenths, then three tenths is definitely bigger than two tenths. Yeah. But if if it's different, then it gets a bit more complicated. So if you have, say, for example, two eighths and three quarters, you're going to need to use an equivalent fraction. So two eighths cool. is the same as one quarter. So one quarter and three quarters. You can see that three quarters is bigger. Okay. Okay. Audience, did you get that? Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. So, so mascots, uh, reveal your cards. First up, it's mighty red. We got. All right, we got four eights. And now, Monty Magpie, what have we got from you? Three quarters or three fourths. So, audience, is three quarters bigger or smaller than four eights? What do we think? Bigger or smaller? Hmm. Bit more difficult. We've got quite a mixed reaction here in the audience. Yeah. OK, all mainly right. Mainly bigger, right? I think, I think mainly think. bigger too. So, Katie, how did they do if they're saying it's bigger? Well, in this case, we can simplify it. We can use an equivalent fraction. So, four eighths is the same as two quarters. And that is smaller than three. So, three quarters is bigger.